If you've been following some of the latest developments in the security industry, you may have seen footage from these new OutView cameras from Uniview. The brightness and vibrancy of the footage often looks like early dusk and sometimes even daytime. And a lot of people might look at the footage and think, oh, that looks edited. But if you count all of the image processing that goes on inside the camera to produce a clear, bright and colorful image, then yeah, technically it is. All of the shots you've seen have been taken in the dead of night when any other camera would struggle to pick up anything close to the detail captured from Uniview's Wise ISP technology. It utilizes various steps of intelligent noise reduction and color restoration to produce the clear images you see here. It's pretty amazing tech, but it's getting even better with the introduction of Alview Plus. Alview Plus is taking low light security a step further. Uniview has increased the sensor size, beefed up the vandal resistance, and added a bunch of additional intelligent surveillance features. As always, Uniview is proving to be at the forefront of cutting edge surveillance tech. Let's go over a quick overview of everything that's been added. Here's a breakdown of the key differences of everything that's been added in the new Alvi Plus cameras. First off, sensor size. Alvi Plus features a larger 1 over 1.2 image sensor compared to the 1 over 1.8 sensor from the standard Alvi. That means more light intake, better clarity and challenging lighting, and cleaner images overall, especially at night. WDR, or Wide Dynamic Range, has also been improved. With that, you're getting 130 decibels of Wide Dynamic Range with the LV Plus versus 120 decibels in the original. That makes a big difference when you're filming in mixed lighting, like bright sunlight pouring through a window or street lights with the shadows at night, and you'll see that at work when you see our test footage. Next, frame rate. LV Plus runs eight megapixel resolution at 30 frames per second, while the standard Alview maxes out at 20 frames per second. Alview Plus takes intelligent processing to the next level with smart intrusion prevention. With the standard Alview, we had access to SIP light, which means cross line with intrusion zones, which were configurable to detect people and vehicles. Now with Plus, we can distinguish between humans, vehicles, and even non-motorized vehicles. You're also getting people flow counting, crowd density monitoring, and auto scene match for smarter response to different environments. Audio and alarm interfaces are also another major upgrade. Alview Plus includes built-in audio inputs and outputs, plus alarm inputs and outputs to give you more options for external alarms and audio devices. Whereas the original Alview only offers a built-in mic, no external control options. Lastly, we have vandal resistance. The Plus model is IK10 rated, giving it more serious protection against physical impact. Perfect for high risk environments where durability matters. So now we're going to head out into the world and do some live testing so you can see just how much the Alview Plus has improved. So for our testing, we drove north from Toronto into the countryside, where there is very little artificial light. To evaluate the camera's dynamic range between light and dark areas, we chose a village community center, an ideal location to test highlights and shadows. To power our cameras, we use the UMV Link Pro Connect box, which allows for direct power and connectivity via Uniview's installer app, UNV Link Pro Tools. For our first test, we set up in the community center parking lot. While the area is generally dark, the building's lights and floodlights provide some ambient lighting. Here's some smartphone footage for comparison. Both cameras perform well here, but we do notice slightly more detail captured by the Alview Plus. Moving on to the next scene, here we filmed in a field behind the community center. As shown in this smartphone footage, lighting was extremely minimal. Even my full frame Sony a7R III struggled to capture the detail, despite maxing out the ISO, lowering the f-stop, and slowing the shutter speed all the way down. Interestingly, in this scenario, both our view cameras actually performed better with the floodlights turned off rather than on. Reviewing the footage from both the Alview and Alview Plus, the difference in image quality is striking. Look at the visible detail on the grass. Thanks to the larger sensor, the Plus captures much more detail in the shadows and highlights. Ghosting from the slower shutter speed is also significantly reduced in the Plus. Next, we captured a scene with strong highlights and dark shadows, utilizing the community center for its light in the background. 
The LV Plus reveals significantly more detail around bright areas. For example, check out the visibility around this car. With the Plus, it's much easier to identify the make, model, and color. In this next test, we wanted to see how the cameras handle identifying details from a vehicle with its lights on. Now keep in mind, these are not license plate recognition cameras, so their ability to read plates at night is limited by their lens focal length. We tested both cameras with WDR turned on and off. In our first test, as the car stops at 50 feet, the LV Plus captures critical identifying details, like the 4x4 tire cover, and even partial license plate details. Now let's turn on WDR for comparison. At 40 feet, we zoom in to compare the license plate's clarity. Once again, the LV Plus shows a clear advantage thanks to its larger sensor. The plate is almost readable at this distance. The standard L view gives a general impression of the characters, but it really lacks the precision of the plus. And here are a few last shots just to summarize the difference in detail. So to summarize, the LV Plus has added a lot of excellent advanced new features that you're definitely going to want to consider those high value locations, especially if you need excellent color quality footage 24-7. If you need even more protection, keep an eye out for LV Plus with TriGuard, which not only brings low light performance, but active deterrence and a newly introduced NEMA 4X protection rating. That's going to be a game changer for anyone looking to integrate at marine and shipping facilities for its corrosive resistance. Say goodbye to salt rusted cameras and a hello to long lasting coastal and industrial protection. That's going to do it for this video. Comment below if you've got footage of the LV Plus that you want to share. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more security insights. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.